So today I simply must review Daryl Lee Soft Australian Licorice Original Flavor. So this is original black licorice. We have a depiction of the licorice on the front. Uh, five pieces is 100 calories. There's a perforation on here. There's a perforation. It's like a papery. That was uh, surprising. Okay, I was expecting it to be plastic and rip open. It was more paper and it ripped. I mean, more of a tear. If that makes sense. Let's see. There's a good sealage right here. Difficult to open with one hand while operating a phone in the other. I won't hold this against the black licorice. It's my mistake. <laughs> well, hopefully, be nice. Wow, this is the first. I can't get this open with one hand. Wow. What is the deal? What is the deal? What is happening right now? I can smell the licorice. I can't get it open. I can't open it. Ah, ha, ha. Yeah, we got it. We got it. Ooh, got that nice... Get a very strong licorice aroma. Now we finally got it open. That was like sealed, man. Ugh. That was ridiculous for me. That was a huge snafu. What do you think? That was a big snafu. What do you think of the smell? I've never given her black licorice before. I, I heard it's fine for them, right? They just can't have too much. Dogs is what I'm, saying, what I'm referring to. It's like this perfect little cylinder. Totally devoid of color. Very interesting. Here we go. Soft Australian licorice original flavor. Wow, that is soft and Australian. Hmm. That is a black licorice taste that I have never... Okay, they're very wet, I will say. They're extremely moist, even to the point of being wet inside the package, I will say. I stuck up on my teeth. That was pretty enjoyable. I think it had a lot of notes that you don't normally get from licorice. It almost like tasted like more complex than your standard black licorice. More things to like focus in on. I don't know if it's the... What else are, yeah, they're all like these perfect cylinders. It's so weird looking at them. It's almost like, and it's shiny and wet, so it's got like an, a, it almost looks like it's animated or like, you know, bad CGI always looks like it's covered in water. It looks like it's coming out of the, I don't know, it is weird. These are not, these are very real. Look, I can squeeze it. It's not CGI. It's not computer generated imagery here. No tricks. No lies. It'll get stuck in every crevice of your teeth. Every single crevice. It's very it's very good to chew. It's got a nice chew. When I first took the first bite, I was like, is this gum? Oh my gosh, am I, am I eating gum right now? Here we go. Gonna eat most of that one. It's kind of like a Tootsie Roll, but if Tootsie Rolls were chewy. I mean, if Tootsie Rolls had this consistency... That would be really good. I'm not going to lie. Wow. I'm like awestruck by this. It's got a very good taste. Let's see if Lucy will eat some. Come here, dog. It looks like she finished it. Do you want do you want some more? You coming back for more? Yeah. Give me licks on my fingers. I mean she likes it. Oh yeah. I mean she likes it a lot. Look at that. Ooh, she really likes the taste of licorice, I, I guess. 
And she's always kind of been like the type of dog who will eat fruit and and whatnot. So I'm not entirely surprised because licorice does have a lot of sugar in it. But I, th I was worried the taste of the uh, the plant would throw her off maybe. I was worried. If you don't like licorice, how can you be my dog? If you don't like black licorice, the only kind of real licorice, right? That's good. Well, you love that, huh? Yeah, that was that was extremely exceptional for black licorice. As far as black licorice goes, that's my favorite, right? That's my favorite is black licorice. I recently had a epiphany, and now I only like black licorice. I don't eat any other candies. It's strange. But as far as that goes, that's probably the best black licorice I've had. I mean, Red Vines black licorice is very good, but... Like, this kind is exceptional. It's fancy, it's delicious, and it's got a good texture, good chew to it. I would ding one point off just because I think, like, it's too mushy. And I get that that's what they're going for. They're going for the soft Australian type of licorice. And so... I can't ding them for that. It says soft. It says soft right on the package. There's no way I can ding them when they're telling me what's going to happen. They're telling me exactly what's going down. And I think ultimately, I would give these a 7 out of 12. That was, a, that was really good.